Where am I? Where the f Oh, this just goes on forever. I'm Spanian. I was raised in the housing areas of Sydney City. Spent most of my youth and adult life in prison. And after a total of 13 years, I'm free and I'm out and about flying around, sussing out the hoods all over the world. It's Oge. Welcome to Bucharest, lad. Welcome to Bucharest. I am smack bang in the middle of Bucharest, Romania. We're going into the hood. I'm nervous and I'm not happy about this one. <laughs> I swear to God. We're going to a place called Ferentari, an extremely dangerous place. So dangerous that at one stage, 2017 was named the fourth most dangerous city on earth with over 17,000 crimes committed, reported, in this one suburb a year. It's a no-go zone. A lot of the places have no electricity and are squatted in. There's apparently needles everywhere. Rubbish gets disposed of on the floor from apartments. It's actually a place that you shouldn't be going by yourself. I'm stressing out a bit. I'll tell you what, back in Australia, I organized for a guide, a local, very hard to find. Told him, he said, yeah, sweet, come. This will be mad. Three days ago, I was in Italy. I said, I'm coming in two days. He said, yep, 17th, we'll do it, blah, blah, blah. I get here, he hasn't opened the message for two days. So, come all the way from Australia, and I'm walking in there solo. I can't not go in. You know what I mean? Yeah, anyway, that's how it goes. That's what happens when you organize a guide. Hard enough to find someone who speaks English. Anyway, it's enough for the stress. I'm stressing, bruh. I'm going into a full no-go zone by myself now. <laughs> it's one bus, the 343. 343, which is, let me find where I'm going, because I'm just walking mindlessly. Oh, apparently it's here. 323. 323, sorry. What bus is this? Oh, this is the bus. <laughs> what a coincidence. What? <laughs> I swear I didn't plan that. All right, at least something's going right. I jumped off the bus there. We're about three streets until the suburb of Ferentari even starts. Five, six minutes walk this way. It's looking pretty mess, messed up already, lad. If I'm gonna be honest with you. Straight out, it's, it's cold in uh, Romania. It's cold, lad. Whenever do you see old Anjos full rugged up like this? I've even got pants on, bruh. So it's like seven degrees, eight degrees. No, top of eight degrees today. I don't know what it is right now. It's like a top of eight degrees Celsius. I'm gonna be honest with you, lad. I'm nervous as hell, bro. Like there's places that, you know, you can go without someone from there. And there's places that you can't. There's a lot of scary places I went by myself, if you've seen my other episodes. This, by researching it, looking at, looking at it on Google and reading about it, this is not one of the places that I would have came to if I knew I was going to be by myself. Ah, <laughs> oh, bruh. But you know, like, if I left, I'd be more disappointed with myself if I didn't, if I didn't do it, you know what I mean? Can't do that, brother. i got yous anyway to keep me company, eh? It's me and you. Me and all of yous. So if they come out with some Ferentari rubbish, you know, you got my back, lad. You can do the ill chase. Expect me to be really secretive with the camera, though. We are now crossing into the start of the suburb Ferentari. This is the nice part. Off its head, lad. Off its head. 
Lad, I'm stressing. <laughs> I'm stressing. What the fuck was that, bro? What the fuck was that, lad? That's the nice part. I can see the bad part off in the distance. There's all coppers across the road. This place is so bad, bro. I can see the bad part from here. I look above the cop cars. See above the cop cars, the flats. Bro, I think this is the main strip of Ferrantari here. Bro, look at the trams they got here. Look how old school the trams are, lad. They look like they're about to break down. That scared the shit out of me. Do you hear that? <laughs> Down these streets here, further, is where all the bad parts are. We crossed the shops, we got off the bus, walked through a little bit of houses. Now it's all just housing from here. We're here. The first set of towers is all here at the end of that street. But the first ones are at the end of this street ahead of us. So. Any minute when these trees disappear, you're gonna see big ass flats. I'll be straight out with you. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna just walk through and point the camera forward so you can see where I'm walking and then stop in places where there's not a whole bunch of people and then have a yarn with you, all right? I'm not gonna walk around with a big selfie stick like Tom Cruise, walk around like George Clooney's in town. I'm gonna to do this smart and calculated, right? Let's ouch. Oh, look at the side of this building here. Look at the side of these flats. Looks like a full industrial factory. Bro, it's so bad, lad. It's so poor here, bro. Look at these buildings, lad. Please don't tell me they're electric cables. Please, bro. There's no way they're live wires. <laughs> they both run from the building, <laughs> two black wires, and they just meet up like that. <laughs> All right, so that's the poor but safe side. Let's get her as in there, bro. All right, down this street in front of me is a long street that leads to, oh, you can see them already, Speak no more Spanian. And they already look worse. First one already looks worse. There's about, I don't know, 40, 50 blocks down here. I'll tell you one thing here, it's not partially empty. You know how heaps of hoods we've gone in and they've been like partially empty, you know, like trying to kick people out. This this one's empty, this one's full, this building's abandoned. None of that here. Every single window has people in it. There's cars everywhere and there's kids and people. Like you can hear them in every building, every window. Let's go in one of these and have a look, bro. See what it's like in here. It's all right in that one, not too bad, not too bad. Let's 
police ahead of me sussing me out, lad. Lad, welcome to the fucking hood, brother. I am smack fucking bang lad. Where am I? Where the f <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna get jumped <laughs> just by looking at this camera. Sorry, bro. What the f was that place, bro? Oh my god, cars. That place was crack, lad. There were people sifting through the rubbish. There was dead rats, needles on the floor. How was that place possible, bro? Now look where we are. Full hood as. Makes this look like <laughs> Beverly Hills, lad. Feels safe here all of a sudden. <laughs> the contrast, you know? Before I was like panicking in a place like this <laughs> And after that we get here now I'm safe bruh <laughs> Whatever those blocks were down there is the worst place I've ever been Bruh it's just non-stop There's so many blocks here See that street there? That's the same street But I went up and turned right past that bloke in the bin that's the same street there, just down 80 meters down there was where all that havoc and rubbish on the floor was. With the map down here. Literally 80 meters up the road. Fair Antari, brother. What? There's cooking up a mad barbecue, lad. Smells hectic. <laughs> I'm lost. I feel like I'm trapped in this cul de sac. Bro, this just goes on forever. I'm trying to get out of here, lad. <laughs> Ninety nine percent sure this is the way out, bro. That went forever, bro. That was crazy, lad. What was that? What was that, lad? All right, bro. We're out. We're safe. <laughs> Look ahead, oh, lad. <laughs> bro, that second set that we just walked through, then that starts there, bro. What was that? What is this? Looks like a prison. As soon as you come out full razor wired up. I'm glad to be out of that one, bro. I'm just gonna say that, lad. Do I wish the lad um, came? He messaged me halfway through, what about that? He responded, he's been working. His boss gave him a shift the whole day today. He didn't have time to look at his phone. He messaged me halfway through. He goes, can you wait for tomorrow? Sorry, bro. I said, brother, I'm here. <laughs> I've sent him my picture of that worst spot. I go, I'm here, bro. It's too late. <laughs> Tomorrow I'm going to Greece anyway. Unfortunate. Would have been good if he came. But that was still good, brother. I like it. You know, I like it by myself. You know what I mean? It's exciting. 
it's exciting <laughs> always thinking you're about to get stabbed and bricked in the back of the head it's very fun I'm, I love it you know the best job in the world anyway brother that's Ferentari Ferentari West and that was Ferentari South that bad part that's it bruh we're out lad we're done it Bucharest see you later next into the hood Adelaide let's oge